the strong color contrasts in van der Weyden's work reveal its contents from quite a distance. This painting consists of two panels. On the right is the elongated body of Christ on the cross. We can see the blood streaming down his body as a result of the big nails through his feet and hands, the thorn crown on his head, and the wound in his side caused by one of the soldiers that wanted to see if Jesus had already died. And if we are not convinced yet by this scene, the skull and bone in the foreground refer to the hill Golgotha, where this crucifixion takes place. And there are even more symbols here. The sign above Jesus' head has an inscription meaning, Jesus of Nazareth, King of the Jews. The dark sky refers to the three hours of darkness during the crucifixion, and the large vermilion banners refer to the blood of Jesus. The left panel shows the Virgin Mary, supported by John the Evangelist. Mary has collapsed with her hands folded in prayer, and the dress of Mary connects both panels with each other. The reason that this painting consists of two panels is that most likely these panels were on top of two doors of an altar. The doors could be opened to enter the interior of the altar, and everyone near the altar would be reminded of the essence of the Christian religion, which is that Jesus had to die on the cross to wash away the sins of the world. <music>